We've all reached that point on a ride where either we can't go any further because there's impassable water or we're landlocked and we can see a spot we want to go but just can't make it. So what's the answer to these problems? It's called an Argo and it's capable of doing things you might not even believe. This Argo is called an 8x8 and is, as you guessed it, an eight-wheel drive amphibious monster. Now while it does look a little bit like a bathtub on wheels, let's take a closer look at what makes an Argo so unique. This Argo is powered by a 748cc electronic fuel-injected Kohler V-twin engine. While the 31 horsepower isn't mind-blowing, it's the abundant torque that helps this little beast go anywhere you point it. A CVT clutch pack delivers smooth, even power from this big EFI mill, but that's where the familiarity to any other vehicle comes to an end. Underneath the floorboards is the heart and soul of what makes up an Argo. A very simple looking, yet complex system of drive chains runs from the main CVT drive shaft and delivers even power to all eight wheels. While this system seems strange, there is method to the madness and it comes in the form of steering. With a chain system running each side, you have the ability to both brake and accelerate each side independently, and this is where the Argo steering comes from. With a simple skid steer-like operation, you can brake the right side and continue to drive with the left, making the Argo steer to the right-hand side. In the old days, Argos were driven and steered with two sticks, one running each side. Nowadays, a simple and familiar handlebar setup with a brake lever and a twist throttle are used. Once you understand the concept of a skid steer type vehicle, Driving the Argo becomes effortless, and when you realize its maneuvering capabilities and the fact that it can turn on a dime, you realize this is far greater than a conventional ATV. Now you might be wondering, where's the suspension on this Argo? And I'm going to show you the simplest eight component suspension system in the world. While the Argo doesn't have an actual suspension, the eight tires running a bit softer than an ATV's do a fairly good job of smoothing out the ride. And while it's not supple and plush like an ATV, keep in mind, it only goes 20 miles an hour. The most important and distinctive feature of the Argo is its amphibious capabilities. And that's the reason why so many outdoorsmen, especially hunters, won't buy anything else. The Argo's on-water capabilities allow it to carry four adults or a whopping 1,000 pounds of cargo. It sure beats swimming, and while the 2.5 miles per hour top speed might not take your breath away, you and your cargo can go places you never thought possible. To go amphibious, there is a sacrifice of suspension and speed, but until your ATV or side-by-side -side grows wings and flies, the Argo is ready and willing to take you places four wheels won't.